Hi guys, I'm John, and this is Honeywell On Demand. I'm here to answer today's burning questions. What is a direct burner ignition, and how does it work? So glad you asked, because direct burner ignition is one of the unsung heroes of a comfortable home. Direct igniters fall into two categories, hot surface ignition and direct spark ignition. Or, if you like alphabet soup, that's HSI and DSI. Let's talk about hot surface ignition, or HSI. When the thermostat registers a call for heat, a control inside the furnace performs a series of steps to efficiently and safely ignite. First, the control cycles the air inside the combustion chamber using an inducer fan. This clears out any residual gas in the chamber. Air pressure switches are in place to ensure this cycling happens. Next, the control in the furnace heats up the tip of the hot surface igniter. Once this heats up, the gas valve opens, releasing gas to the main burner. The HSI lights the gas and creates a flame in the main burner, setting off the heating process. A lot of hot surface igniters are made with silicon carbide, a compound that tends to be a bit fragile. HSIs can also be made with silicon nitride, which is more durable and energy efficient. An example of this type of igniter is Honeywell's most popular HSI, the Glowfly, which consistently outperforms and outlasts silicon carbide igniters. The Glowfly also works with a number of different ignition boards and modules, like our S9200U integrated furnace control board. Another type of igniter is the Direct Spark Igniter, or DSI. They've been around for a while, but still do a solid job. The DSI works a little like a propane grill for your barbecue. The spark inside the igniter lights the gas, which creates the flame, and done. The direct spark igniter uses voltage to spark, which lights the main burner directly. Once the spark begins, a control module, like the S9200U I mentioned earlier, tells the gas valve to open. This releases gas to the main burner where the spark ignites the gas and creates a flame in the main burner. Bottom line, you can't go wrong with either a hot surface igniter or a direct spark igniter. You guys, is it just me or is it hot in here? Well, thanks for watching. See you next time on Honeywell On Demand.